Number three. Fresno State is ready to open this one up as they line up for the opening kick. He really got a hold of that kick. And this one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. Let's go! Round 15! Fires quickly to the tight end. Tackle made right around the 38-yard line. Well, that's the beauty of running play action against zone coverage. In man, the defender has his eyes on the guy's covering. But in zone, the defender's looking right at the quarterback. That's why that play action worked so well for a first down. They weren't sure if it was a run or a pass. Where in the world was he going on that run? Well, that's a good question. I thought for a while he got his directions messed up. It's second down now and 14 to go. Ball on their own 34. Six, man. Check curls, check curls. Goes quick to the receiver and it falls incomplete. Good effort there by the receiver. But just not enough room for him to get a foot down in bounds. Going right, intercepted. He seemed a little hesitant on that throw. And that left the defender time to break on the ball and pick it off. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 33-yard line. He's pushed out of bounds at about the 27-yard line. That'll make it second and four. here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. So it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. A quarterback's best friend is a receiver he can count on to catch the ball every time he drops back the pass. He's taken down at the one-yard line. That makes it first and goal. Mike seven, Mike seven. Here we go. Easy, easy, easy. Here's the pitch, and now he's got the corner. He splits the uprights with the extra point. A five-play, 33-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. The score now, 7-0. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Bulldogs are right where they want to be early in this one, partner. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. I'm sure the quarterback would love to make amends for that last pick. It may be early, but don't think the coaches haven't spent a lot of time reminding these guys how important it is to take care of the football. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. This safety is as vicious a player as you're going to find. He will make the tackle every single time. Played the snap count perfectly. Found the path into the backfield and didn't let the quarterback get away. So no luck on that drive as they go three and out. Fourth and long here after the sack. The defense has everybody on the line. I think they're going to come after this one. It's away and it's a booming punt. Tackle made at the 41-yard line. I'm sure that touchdown on their last possession's given them some confidence, but let's see if that carries them back down the field. 
Well, I think this defense has got to do something because right now the quarterback is in such a good rhythm that you've got to do something to try to get him out of it. I would suggest trying to bring more pressure. Try to come up with an exotic blitz look to try to get him on his heels as opposed to being the aggressor and attacking the defense. Brought down at the 44-yard line. Gain of 10 on the play. First down. Fresno State is up by a touchdown. Here we go! Easy, easy, easy! Eagle! And he carries the ball for a nice game. Ball carrier. Gain of seven yards. That'll bring up second and three. Let's heat it up. Seven's a mic. Let's go! Easy, easy, easy! And down he goes at the 28 yard line. That's how we do, D. That's how we do. We don't want none of this. First down. Let's go! Caught open field. He's tackled at about the 19 yard line. That's good for a game of nine yards. That brings up second and one. Quick out to his receiver. And that sets them up with a first and goal. That's a game of 12 on the play. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. Mike seven, Mike seven. Tackle at the nine. Well, you think about receivers coming over the middle taking shots from the safety, but a runner who's still in the backfield, this guy just flies all over the field. And this is the eighth play of the drive. In the shotgun and five wideouts. Touchdown, Fresno State. He hits the PAT. A nice eight play, 59 yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. You know, Brad, a lot of times you have to watch practice and watch a seven on seven drill to not see the ball touch the ground. But this time they went the entire length of the field. The ball never touched the ground. Great execution by the quarterback and the receiver. So the score now 14 0. Fresno State's looking awfully impressive right now in defense, but we are in the first quarter. Yeah, this is about a dominant first quarter that we have seen in a long time. But let's see if they can continue to play this well throughout the rest of the ball game. Not a lot of success for this offense on their last trip out. They've been beaten soundly on both sides of the ball, and we haven't even gotten to the second quarter. And they make the stop, the 36-yard line. You like to see a team having success like this running the football. It can really open up things for the offense. Those 10 yards look easy. He tackles him for a loss. The offense knows that the linebackers are cheating up a little bit on the run. If they can get some protection, they might want to open up a little bit of space for some passes underneath. From their own 41 yard line. Third down. And a nice catch there before he stepped out of bounds. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it and make a catch. And he's tackled at the 44. You've got to admire the intensity that these linebackers bring to the table. As soon as he saw it was staying on the ground, he made a beeline for the ball carrier. Second and 13. Ball on the 44-yard line. And he's taken down at about the 39-yard line. You know, at that point, 
point, I think, Brad, the quarterbacks are just better off just taking a sack. You have to be very careful as you're feeling pressure to throw the ball just to throw the ball. If you feel like you're not going to be able to make a play and the defense got you, just give up on that play and get ready for the next down. And he nails a long field goal. Great snap and a perfect hold, and he just had an awesome follow-through. Everything went right there on that long field goal. 14-3, Fresno State. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Fresno State's offense really came to play in this one, Kirk. They're punching it in for six early and off. Yeah, give them all the credit in the world. Not only are they executing well, but they're finding the mismatches and taking advantage of them. The quarterback is on his way back onto the field, and he led a great drive last time out. Got it, but they're going to lose you. He was tackled immediately. Second down, 12 to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. Incomplete. It's knocked down by the defense. It's an intelligent play by the defender. All you have to do sometimes is get your hand on the ball. Bring him down at the 13-yard line. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five-wide outlook. And now he's got room to run. Good outside run there. That'll bring it in to the first quarter of action. 14-3, Fresno State. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. And they hit him in the backfield. Loss of two by the halfback. They'll line it up again on third down. He's scrambling. Tackle made around the four-yard line. He scrambles and picks up five. They're all tied in on the line here on fourth and short. He's taken down at the two-yard line. That makes it first and goal. Touchdown. So this entire group functions so well as a unit, and you saw it on that touchdown. Very good team effort. And he tacks on the extra point. So a nine-play, 75-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run in the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown. Game. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. It's still only the second quarter. We've got a lot of football left, but I've got to say, this one is teetering on the brink of a blowout. And he throws it away. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 25. Go. He gets rid of this one. Go. 
Quick strike, and he drops it. Can't ask for much more than a three and out. Great job, defense. That'll make it fourth and ten. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. And he's taken down at the 26. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead. And on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. Great pressure on the quarterback forced that incompletion. Boy, they really pounded him on that throw. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 26. Looks for his tight end over the middle. Brought down at the 33 yard line. Number 18 on the tackle at the 33 yard line. That makes it third and three. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. That's a team of seven on the play. First down. Four down, four down. Mike seven. Mike seven. Here we go. Easy, easy, easy. It's caught first down, and he's out of bounds. When you can move the ball downfield in big chunks like that, you've got the defense right where you want them. Take four, take four. Seven to Mike. Nice run, and he's brought down. So he calls his own number and gets about six yards. That'll make it second and four. He has some room. He's at the 30, makes it out to about the 26. Here's the eighth play of the series. Now he's scrambling. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. That makes it second and 10. Makes it out to about the 13. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That's a team of four. That makes it second and six. Caught and out of bounds after a short game. That's good for a game. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. They've got their goal line sets on the field. This might be a good time for play action. Touchdown, Bulldogs. He makes the PAT. Fresno State ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. I'm really surprised how lopsided this first half has been. But this is college football, and no matter what the score is, the adrenaline's always pumping on both sides. Utah's going to take their first time out of the half. Nothing flashy at all, but now that first down marker is a lot closer. It's second down, six yards to go. Ball on their own 29. Makes the first down catch. And down he goes at the 43-yard line. The defense has got some of their best pass defenders on the field. They set up in the dime to counter that five wide receiver set. He's on the run.
So the sack makes this a second and long. Got his receiver, but it's knocked down. The sub package in there defensively in this five wide receiver set. That's a great tackle at the 28. But the defense is fired up, responding and reacting to that sack. Not only do they get the quarterback, but they hit him and hit him hard. I think that could really create some confidence for this defense. The next time this quarterback drops back to throw, you got to be thinking he's going to be a little bit gun shy and concerned about the pressure that these defense is putting on him. Brought down at the 34. The Bulldogs right now are getting the play out of their quarterback that they expected, maybe even better than they expected. And now, as we get near halftime, there's going to have to be some adjustments made on the other side of the ball. Well, the defense has got to be happy we're getting close to halftime so they can go back to the drawing board and try to figure out a way to slow down this quarterback. Uh, I think that more often than not, you look back at the first half and you think about, okay, let's eliminate this, this, and this, and let's maybe try a completely different way of, of trying to attack him. In my opinion, They've got to take some chances and be more aggressive in trying to put pressure on it. What they've done so far hasn't worked. And he's immediately tackled. Not a bad little play there. Yeah, this is a nice job by the quarterback reading the coverage and delivering a very catchable ball and allowing his receiver to come up with a nice game. Fresno State comes to the line. They've got a big advantage in this one. He makes it out to maybe the 46-yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 46. from the pressure. This quarterback has to do a better job of avoiding the rush because sacks can be real drive killers. And a quick throw. The 10. And he scores. Touchdown. That's TD pass number three. This quarterback is going to continue to tear him up until they get some pressure on him. And he converts the extra point. They line up to kick this one away. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. Makes it out to about the 39. Utah's going to have to use their second time out of the half. First and 10, ball on the 39-yard line. Quick throw out to the receiver. He's tackled at the 41. Throws complete. He's got space to work. And he shoved out of bounds right around the 42-yard line. From the 42-yard line. First down. Tackle at the 35. This is smart, efficient play call. You don't need to make the highlight reel on each play. The Utes using their third and final timeout. It's up. And he got it. You know, I was wondering if he's going to get a chance to kick one of those. We saw him warming up from 60 yards before the game. So the score now, Fresno State 35, Utah 6. I have a feeling this ball is going nowhere near the return man with this kickoff, most likely to end the half. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. 
The offense will come out again, hoping to have similar results as their last drive. <laughs> this offensive coordinator's got to be feeling so good about the execution that he's seeing from his quarterback and his wide receiver. Because again, they put so much time into trying to put a plan together, and to be able to see that actually come into play makes you feel pretty good as a play caller. Well, we played a half of football. Fresno State's got a huge lead. we played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. This game looks like Blowout City. I don't think I'm crazy, David Pollock. I don't think it's taking up residence in Blowout City. I think it's just passing through and visiting. Uh, we might have a comeback in store in the second half. Well, I think you're crazy, and you need to go to the halfway house and visit and stay for a while because this game isn't going anywhere back the other direction. It's over. Put the women and children to bed. Go nope. find something else a little bit more entertaining. No. Nope. Open a bag of chips. You know, start another season of something else because this, nope. one's, this one's a wrap. There's going to be a comeback. So you're saying there's a chance. David and I will stay locked in on everything going on in college football. It's going to wrap it up here in the studio. Just about time to get you out to your second half. Brad and Kirk ready with a call. Reese, David, wish you were here instead of Kirk and I. We start the second half in this lopsided ball game. He really got a hold of that kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. They're ready to begin another drive. Fresno State looking to add to this big lead here. And he's taken down right around the 28-yard line. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. And they make the stop around the 35-yard line. Man, that was an impressive-looking play. When you can slice apart a defense like that, it puts a seed of doubt in their minds. Nice run up the middle. A four-yard gain by the halfback on the option. That makes it second and six. And he's tackled around the 23-yard line. Game eight, eight on the play. play. Let's go, that, that makes it first and ten. ten. Long day, offense. It's going to be a long day. Seven's a mic. Mike seven. Catches it, and he's looking for more. They'll bring him down. That's the 12. Get out of here. Let's go. Number four brings him down at the 12-yard line. First down. Let's go. He fights forward to about the 10. That makes it second and eight. It's second and eight. Ball on the 10. They bring him down in the backfield. Think about the speed and instincts it takes for a linebacker to get from his position into the backfield to make a play like that. That's well done. And this play is number eight on the drive. Fresno State comes to the line in complete control of this game. Throws complete, big loss. Five-yard loss on the play. That play was sort of out of sync from the start, but you have to also recognize that the defense made a great play. They read it from the get-go. So the kicking team is on the field. They'll try for three. This is to add to an already impressive lead. The kick is up, and it's good. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. 
and it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Fresno State's coaches just got to be happy. I'd love to coach a kid like this. Oh, I think these coaches love to coach a guy like this, and another great performance by him individually and for this offense. I hope they show some fight here and try to stay competitive. If you're going to get blown out, you at least want to go down swinging. He's wrapped up for the sack. There's sack number four. Well, he's being forced to make really quick decisions because he doesn't have any time to throw the ball. That's going to lead to turnovers. Defense looking for another sack in the second down and long situation. Go, go. Completely stopped immediately. So the defense does their job well on that series. That's good for the game four yards. Fourth down. And this one is a beauty. He makes it to the 38-yard line. Made a few guys miss on his way to a quality return. Both sides have made their way back out, and we're just about set to get going again. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. He's out of bounds at the 49-yard line. That's, That's good, good for a gain of 13 yards. yards. No First down. down. Fresno State up by a big seven margin. Mike. Mike seven. Gets it out in a hurry. He got it. And a huge lead is about to get a little bit bigger. He's ringing up the points with all these touchdown throws. That's his fourth. Well, he's shown such great poise back there in the pocket. That's the main reason he's been able to find the end zone so many times. He splits the uprights with the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Not a whole lot's been working for them so far. They should just come out and play loose and easy because they've got nothing to lose. Throws complete. He's hammered. They get five yards on the play. Not a bad play. They gain five yards out of it and keep moving the defense back. There's a strike complete. Tackle made around the 38-yard line. Seven yard line. That brings up second and one. Quick throw, and he's got his receiver again. He's taken down at the 42. yard line. First down. He's gobbled up in the backfield. Play and it's 
going to be first and goal. That makes it first and goal. Got a man, open touchdown. So they go to the air, and they come away with six, Kirk. And Brad, I got to tell you, that's not an easy thing to do there. The defenses nowadays are so tough when you get inside the red zone. And he adds the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And they can forget about returning this one. The Bulldogs had that hot hand on offense, and they just keep on going here in quarter number three. The greatest thing you can say about these guys today is consistency. They are moving the football and putting points up on the board. They're going to be tough to beat. Six points and a pretty display of passing was a result of their last drive. Kirk, do you expect the defense? Fumble! And the defense picks it up. And down he goes at the 31. I'll tell you, when a guy as big as this lineman gets his paws on a loose ball, you can pretty much forget about it. You're not getting the ball back from him. The offense ready for the first play of this drive. They moved the ball extremely well on their last possession on their way to the end zone. You know, when this defense went over to the sideline based on the way they've been playing so far, this defense coordinator has got to be living. He's got to get in their face. He's got to challenge them. He's got to get their emotions going. Because when you play defense, it's not just about X's and O's. It's about attitude and playing with a lot of confidence. They'll spread the field with five wide. He gets rid of this one. Third down, and they need to get it to the 21. Throws complete, he's got room to work. Touchdown, Utah! Nicely designed play to the wide receiver, and it got him six. You said it, Brad, in a good time to call it. I tip my hat to the offensive coordinator. That receiver was so wide open as a quarterback, you just don't want to blow it. That's like having a wide open layup with nobody behind you, and you go up and you miss a layup. You don't want that to happen to you as a quarterback. So the quarterback did a nice job of staying in rhythm, making the easy throw and the touchdown for this wide receiver. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. And what a game it's been for this quarterback, Kirk. Oh, he's obviously come in here with a plan. He knows what he wants to do, and he's just getting the job done. All of his success has led to their advantage on the scoreboard. A fumble really hurt this team's last drive, so let's see if they can make up for that blunder on this drive. Anytime you give the ball away, it's a disappointment. So these guys want to show that they can hang on to it. Only three yards there on the throw. It's a nice play by the defense to shut down all the lanes, so this halfback wasn't able to make anything happen on that play. Fresno State looking to build on this commanding lead here. Not much of a contest here as we head into the final stanza. Fresno State's running away with it. Well, folks, we head into the fourth quarter, and this one is a blowout. Got it. Complete. He's out of bounds. First down. Man, left, First left, down, left. 10 to go. Ball on their own 37. Mike. Mike seven. He gets it out to about the 47 yard line. That's a game of 16. That makes it first and 10. Ready! 
He sails it long. He almost had it, but it's incomplete. Man, I don't know if this quarterback misread the defense or just made a poor decision, but that wasn't a pass he should have thrown. It's second and ten. Ball on the 47-yard line. And he throws it away. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Complete. He's got room, and he's level at the 41-yard line. It'll be short of the first after the completion. Well, good effort by the defense to make sure they got him before he got to the marker. Fresno State looking to put this game away if they score here. That was a nice little pooch kick right there. And that's why they made the decision to punt the ball right there. They wanted to pin this offense deep in their own territory. This team really trusts their defense. I don't expect any once-in-a-lifetime rallies here, but that being said, we could still see some exciting plays. And a quick throw. He's tackled at the 25. a sack on the play. That'll bring up second and 12. From their own 23-yard line, it's second down. Gets the ball here and brought down in the backfield. That brings up third and They come out in a five-wide set. That's a great tackle at the 15. They've really thrown the quarterback's rhythm off and rattled his confidence with such a relentless pass rush. He's not himself out there at all today. Fourth and long here after the sack. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. Tackle the 39-yard line. Fresno State's proven to be the better team in every facet of this football game. Boy, their defense has played lights out. Their offense is taking advantage of their opportunities. Everything has led them to a very comfortable lead. Both teams are playing out the stretch here. You want to get experience for guys who normally don't get in the game and try to avoid injuries. Gains his way to the 49-yard line. First down. From their own 49-yard line. First down. Less than three minutes in the game. Ready! Black at five! A couple, maybe three yards on that run. That'll make it second and seven. He's at the 40. Tackle at the 36. That makes it first and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. And now he's got room to run, and he is drilled at the 26. That's a team of ten on the play. First down. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. Seven's a much. Makes it to the 14. So the run goes for another first down. And Kirk, they're really having some trouble stopping this kid on this drive. The offense is just winning the battle up front. Right now, the defense knows the run is coming. They just can't stop it. 
The Bulldogs know that they have to enjoy this guy while they've got him because somewhere down the line he's going to be at the next level. Well, that'll definitely be in his future, but for now he needs to sit back and just enjoy this performance and, and really the play caller, the quarterback, the offensive line, the receivers, the entire group as, as, as just a whole should feel good about their performance. That does it for this edition of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long.